Ah, oh, that's better. Right, I'll give that a couple of minutes if I were you. Right, in this episode, we're going to see how to make this. Yes, it's a fire sword. In an episode I like to call Some Enchanting Evening. There's one for the teenagers. Ugh. Right, hello, this is Jamie from randomizeuser.com. We're here in Vera Chul in Savage Lands because now we're going to tonk some Draymars. Hello, pal. I actually might want to get a sword out. Hang on. Tonk, 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 tonk. And you're gone. Right, so the reason why I'm tonking Draymar, or spirit skeletons, is this. They've just introduced soul remnants, uh, which doesn't sound very exciting, but it is. And because they've just introduced enchanting into the game for the first time, here at the end of July 2016. It's a bit limited at the moment, you can only do it to a few weapons, and there's only one effect you can do. So, let's have a look. Uh, okay. Right, so we have to go down to, I think it's some... Um, Infernal. Here we go. These are the the current enchantable weapons. That you take a gold um, axe, battle axe, great sword, or sword. There's one, a gold sword, uh, and you add some soul remnants, some infernal stone shards, and some searing blood, and put it all together, and you get a flaming sword. So I haven't done this yet, um, but we're going to. So that's why I'm here at Virachul tonking Draymars in the nut of a shell, or is it vice versa? I think it is vice versa. Now, soul... Re oh, no. <laughs> God damn it. Stop doing that. We've had words about that before. <laughs> so, uh, yeah. Anyway, so, yes, yeah, soul remnants are a, a, sl are a strange ingredient that drop from spirit creatures, such as spirit skeletons, or Draymars, as they kind of used to be called, sort of. Uh, just grab his stuff. Now, the thing is with spirit, um, spirit things is they only appear at night. Um, so, I mean, this is this is a reliable place to find Draymars. Um, I went looking for them in the uh, the usual places, in the swamps, um, yesterday, and for some reason they didn't spawn, so I'm not quite sure if that's changed. So that's why I'm here at Vera Chul in the first place. Nothing's spawning now! God damn it, I haven't got enough soul remnants. You need a hundred. You need one bloody hundred, otherwise you're going nowhere fast. Yeah, nothing's spawning at the moment. Maybe I'll try and... Oh, there's, there's the law for Vera Chul. We haven't read this yet, I don't think. We arrived this morning to find the rumours were true. All of Vera Chul was abandoned for no apparent reason. The village is the most fortified in all of Tarvas. The solid buildings and walls still intact. In spite of this, there is not a single soul in sight. Something feels off. I feel like I'm being watched. I suspect that whatever caused the villagers to leave still lingers here. Well, it doesn't seem to bloody be spawning, does it? You bloody bastards. Oh, there's one! Hello! Coming round from the corner. Currently using, um, oh yeah, plenty of spawns now. Currently using a wolfsbane and a flesh ripper to do the tonking. I'm trying to avoid using the shadow shroud because that was donated to me. I didn't get that honestly, so I'm not allowed to use it. Right, oh come back! <laughs> I think he's scared. He he knows what's a coming. Right, I'm gonna keep on doing this for a while um, because otherwise the entire video is just gonna be me here. Um, and now, once I've got a hundred, um, we shall go and. Well, get the rest of the ingredients, I guess. You! You there! St stop slacking and get tonked! Hi. And these are definitely not as hard as Draymar. Um, I don't think we've got the, um, the aura of cold, because Dr Draymar used to have an aura of cold that when you were close to him, you just... I don't, did I even pick that up? No, I didn't. Um, that used to sap your um, warmth, but not anymore. Some enchanting evening, you may slay a Draymar. Shout out to Perry Como. Right, I've got plenty. I've got absolutely loads of this stuff now. Not even going to bother killing him, because he's fallen off the stairs. So, fuck him. Right, so I'm going to notionally go back to centre point, but there's firstly something that we have to do. We have to go via the Infernals. The Inferno Stone, the Infernal Stone, whatever you want to call it. There's one on Snowmere, uh, and there's also one on Fraidlin. And Fraidlin is the... well... We're there right now, and we're very, we're actually surprisingly close to it. We just have to go along the wall, and we will get there quite nicely. So I'm just going round here. Now, you might have noticed in my inventory that I already have uh, just about enough um, Inferno Stone fragments to do this. But I'm trying to get a bit more for some, a bit more surplus. I've got more than 200 soul um, remnants, as you can see, from Tonking Draymars, which means I'll be able to, um, in future... And get another infernal sword or whatever. So I'll have enough for two rather than just one, which I think is nicely future proofing. 
Anyway, on the wall here, um, main notice from previous videos that there's no bloody um, baddies on here at all now, uh, which is rather strange. I'm sure they'll... Because there, there were Furies, and then they pretty much removed all Furies from Fraidlin a while back. So everywhere's a lot safer now, which is very strange, and I think they'll do something about that, because look at this, there's nothing. There might be... There may be some... Ske there isn't any even some running skeletons. I think I think something's gone wrong. I think, um, yeah, this this can't be right. Remember, actually, there's a bit of lore I got from here in one of the previous episodes, um, in which I was in mortal danger, and it was well exciting. But now there's no bugger about. I wish also, it's coming up to morning. Thank God. That made the video actually visible. And I'm actually really out of stamina as well. Right, so the Infernal Stone, if you don't already know, is at the end of the wall, the other end, towards the tower, in that Serdramar um, area. And where there used to be Furies as well, but now they're not. As usual, I do this disclaimer every so often, but it's always good to remind that, yeah, anything that you see in this video may change because we're still in early access. Oh, hello. I keep forgetting that exists. That's a, a really kind of like a pathetic portal that goes pretty much nowhere but up in the air a bit. Uh, right, okay, so let's just jump down towards the Inferno Stone. There it is. Now, we are very close to Cursed Tower, and I know from previous experience, Kerr can actually attack you when you're mining the Inferno Stone, dicks! This is not a good way round to doing it. I don't know why I came this way. Like a bloody mountain goat. Right, round here. Uh, I've already got my mining hammer out. Hey, there we go. This is a gold one. You can't enchant this yet. Apparently, that might be coming because at the moment, there's only, as, a, as I've already mentioned, there's only a few things, a few gold things you can enchant, but there will be more. It'll be expanded possibly in the next patch. Now, as we all know, the Inferno Stone hurts you when you go near it. You start burning up, but I've got some wicked ass armor. Um, some dragon scale stuff, so we should be fine. We'll hear the horrible amounts of pain using my gold hammer. Um, we should five hits, six hits, seven hits, eight hits, nine hits, ten hits. Uh, right, grab that. Stop the pain. Um, my armor has barely been touched, but it has depleted a little bit. Uh, my health has is completely untouched. Uh, I think um, it, it attacks the armor before it attacks your health. I have to get rid of you, because we're not at home to you. And then you just keep on doing it. Um, I'm going to mine a little bit more. Um, I'm going to get up to 12, so I've got enough for two uh, flaming swords. So I shall see you on the other side of this. If I haven't burnt up... Imagine being the voice actor doing that. Obviously having a whale of a time. <laughs> right, so I've got plenty of shardage. So now we go back to... Oh no, oh hello. <laughs> hello mate. I was going to say, we, we, should, we could go back to centre point, but there's actually a little point um, of going to the centre. Uh, because we need to actually go to Jamanga. So, let's just go to crafting. Um, as you can see, we've now got plenty of soul remnants, we've got plenty of stone shards, but we haven't got searing blood. And as we know from a few episodes ago, the way to get searing blood is to kill infernal ghouls over on Jamanga. Now, I could go to the portal, um, but that's a bit of a sludgy trudge. So... Um, I'm going to um, jump onto a different save where I'm already on the island. Um, just, to, just to show you how much damage that um, the um, mining the Inferno Stone did. As you can see, my armor's gone down a little, and I will need to start repairing it. However, dra dragon scale armor, I just need to um, use a repair hammer at a crafting table, so that's no biggie. Not an expensive uh, repair job. Right, okay, so I'll see you on the other side. Don't look back, your manga. Etc. It's singing day here on... Oh, hello. Oh, no. That's not what I want. So, yeah, it's not... <laughs> it's not going very well. I think it, maybe Infernal Ghouls only do spawn at night. Ah. So, I just need to address my food situation. Uh, I haven't got, even got any bloody wood. There we go. We need to cook uh, some... So, cook some bloody rabbit meat. That's all I've got at the moment. I can't believe I've let myself go so slack. Right. Sundered... Oh, I've got sun, I've got Sundered Surprise if I wanted it. I've got loads. Oh, I've got loads of keylet meat as well. Uh, maybe I'm, that's the one thing I never actually see in my inventory uh, because it's um, a different colour to the rest of the meat. Uh, well, maybe I haven't got any keylet meat, um, so I'll have to, I'll have to eat rabbit meat. Huh, it'll do. It'll get me back up to strength anyway. Right, let's find those bloody infernal ghouls. Down through the fire. Right, it's nearly night time. My armor's taking a bit of a pounding. I've been fighting Grinfells and even Trogers 
and got absolutely bugger all of interest from the drops, sadly. Oh god, there's some Infernal X. Uh, we don't want them. Um, there's a couple of things I've been discovering, actually, I didn't really notice. Um, I think um, that I've been put in the last updates or so. For instance, um, spirit orbs are now called summoning orbs. Su uh, because summoning orbs. And because I think their use is now um, pretty much um, focused entirely on the multiplayer thing of summoning other people to your position. So they're now summoning shards and summoning orbs. Oh, hello, there we go, finally! Um, also, wood now chops down much easier than it did, because for a while um, it took ages, and the only real logical way of getting wood was to burn trees down and then chop it. Uh, but now that's been um, rebalanced again, like it was in the like, like it was in the early days. Uh, oh no! Uh, I don't want you involved. Ah, oh, this is going to be ah oh, pricks. Thank God I've got this dragon scale armor. Um, oh, I'm just have to fight this Grinfell as well, aren't I? Oh God, look at this! This is this is a horror. Uh, I'm just going to do the old circle roo. Um, I'm going to have to take some hits from the Grinfell, I think. Oh, bloody hell. Okay. No, you're the... Oh, God. Where's the Grinfell gone? Oh, God, he's, he's behind me. Little fuck. Okay, I'm definitely going to have to concentrate on him, because he's the one that can get through my armour, maybe. Oh, no, I, this may actually have piercing protection, actually, so we should be okay. I don't recommend... Oh, no, there's another one. I don't recommend this without <laughs> taking on four, five at once without some serious fucking armour and swordage. Yeah. I really should double Wolfsbane, because I think Wolfsbane is better than uh, Flesh Ripper. Oh, I could use my Shadow Shroud, but as I say, the honour system means I can't. <laughs> oh, come on. Oh, oh no. Bloody hell. Okay, I've got one of them. I heard the, I heard the telltale cry. This, hopefully, I'll be... Oh, no, I can't see a thing. <laughs> hopefully this will get me all the, the searing blood that I need. Uh, yeah, they do only seem to come out at night. All the better to show off their cool... Oh, look at the moon! Actually, don't look at the moon, because I'm going to die. <laughs> right, almost dead. Almost dead. Almost de Come on, look at my armour. My armour. And you can see the little doll in the bottom right showing my armour is getting depleted. Uh, oh, come on. One. Oh, okay, one more. Two more to go. One, and one more One more to go. One down. One, oh, four down. One to go. Well, numbers. Something. Just die. <sighs> you fucks. You fucks, the lot of you. My god. Oh, Bark! <laughs> the most exciting thing of all. Oh, I've got a Shard of Draconis, um, which is nice. Uh, let's see, what else have we got? Oh, yep, there we go. There's a first Searing Blood and a delicious Sundered Surprise. I've got, oh, I've got the Fang. I've got another Fang. Oh, this is not going to work, is it? Oh, this is Fang City. Oh, Fangaroo. Uh, I've already got three in total of the Searing Blood. Not to be mixed up with the Blood of the Brood. So I, I still need three more. So this might be a long night. Ah, uh, look, my helmet's gone. Um, I've had to swap to Wolfsbane because my Flesh Ripper ran out. Um, but thankfully, I think that's it. That's all the searing blood. Um, I'm never going to bloody... I can't be bothered to do it anymore. <laughs> I was going to get some surplus, but that would require killing loads. Oh, bloody hell. Um, and that would require being probably here for another night. So yeah, fuck it. Let's go back to centre point. Finally. Do, 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 do. Oh, not in the best place here. Um, stairs of Surgimar. Oh, I didn't know what it was called that. Huh. Right, so centre point. Where the fuck is centre point gone? I'm coming at it from an unusual angle. Uh, <laughs> bloody fog. It's down there somewhere. Ow. No fall damage still. After all these bloody years. Oh, hello. What was that? <laughs> is that a dragon? Is that Kerr being a prick? Probably. Flew in front of the sun. Flunt is a word. Okay, let's try... <laughs> I'm lost. I'm kind of lost. I, I think I have to go... Hang on, centre point is on the far bank. So... I need to go this way. Yes, it's over there. I'm fine, everyone. I'm fine, I'm fine, I'm fine. Uh, just a slight brain stupid. Right. ha, 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 ha. Right, first things first. Let's sort out the repairs. Broken dragon scale helmet, one repair hammer, crafting table available, and we're back up to full strength. Whilst I'm at it, because it costs me almost nothing to do, just get all my armour back up to speed. Also, the broken flesh ripper. That's back up to speed as well. Oh, fuck. Come back, flesh ripper. <laughs> you daft prick. Uh, right, so I'm going to put that into there. And also repair one of my will spades, because one of them is a bit depleted. 
Uh, 33%, that's the one. Good. Back up to full strength. Right, let's craft this bloody fire sword then. Right. Yeah. Uh, huh. Huh. In infernal sword. It is worth pointing out uh, that um, all these require the same. So axe, battle axe, and great sword all require um, 100 soul remnants, 6 inferno shards, and 6 um, searing blood. Um, yeah, just demonstrating that. Um, all, of the, all of them, of course, also need their base weapon. Now, as you can see, the, um, the infernal sword is no longer there because it's now craftable. Yes! There we go. A golden sword imbued with mystic fire. Damage 84. Um, building damage 72. Rare. And compare that to Wolfsbane. Um, doo -doo -doo -doo. Damage 95. You see, again, it's not... Um, is, and Wolfsbane still is the best. But um, the Infernal Sword has one important thing, and that, that it, in that it warms you up, I think. <laughs> I think. Um, otherwise, what's the bloody point? So, let's let's get some. Sp oh, hello, <laughs> mate. Oh, there you are, just wandering around the place. In fact, hang on. Let's tonk him with this. Ha 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 ha! Kill. Oh, it's a fast swinger. Ooh. Well, let's compare that to an actual rage bait. No, not rage bait. <laughs> a wolf spain. Oh, that's actually very fast as well. So, in fact, let me just put them. Put those there and sob the flesh, flesh ripper. So, yeah, a rather tasty combination. Uh, is it warming me up though? I have a feeling it might only be the two-handed weapons that actually. Oh yeah, it is marginally. If you look at my blue bar in the bottom right, um, the fact that the red and the blue bar don't currently meet does mean that I am incredibly slowly literally, warming up. Uh, I, I mean, I, I, so I haven't actually pr played with these at all yet. This is the first one I've crafted, so I haven't um, experimented with the numbers or anything. But yeah, by the looks of it, it warms you up incredibly slowly. I seem to remember... Oh, there's a different kind of X. I seem to be at the, the, the confluence of two tribes here. Uh, yeah, um, I think I remember from the, uh, the the developers' Twitch streams that... Um, bloody hell. They do... Uh, these swords do warm you up. However, not always. I mean, it's only, it's only marginal. And if it's night time and snowing... Um, it won't actually warm you up, um, which I think is good because I think it's balanced this way. Because you don't want one that when you when you equip it, your, your cold just disappears. Otherwise, when you're in the end game, cold will simply cease to have any meaning whatsoever. So this is very early days for enchantment, as I've said, and this is the very first pass of it. And they will be tweaking it, adding new kinds of enchantments, adding new things to actually enchant. Probably keeping on the gold theme. Okay, so hopefully next time more enchanting, uh, but we don't know yet. We'll see how the game goes. Uh, okay, so subscribe for future episodes, and I shall see you next time. Bye-bye.